What's up everybody? My name is Scott. You're watching Kentucky Ballistics and today is Full Auto Friday. I want to apologize about the wind. The weather is awful here. If you can't tell, it's not exactly a beautiful day today. Last week it rained literally every single day and we weren't able to film Full Auto Friday. That's why we didn't post a Full Auto Friday last week. I am so sorry that we didn't post one last week. It pained me not to post a video. We haven't missed a Full Auto Friday since we started this series. So it really sucked having to miss one, but we're resuming today. Today is Full Auto Friday, and today we're gonna shoot one 16-inch block of 10% ballistic gel with the MP5. I've got it set up over here. We're gonna get loaded up, and we're gonna blast it. Okay, it's squatted down here. We've got our MP5. We're gonna be loaded up with some 124 grain full metal jackets as usual. And we're about seven yards back. I can't believe that block stayed on the table. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just cut right through that. Let's go ahead and do it one more time. That never gets old. All right, let's check this out. We have multiple holes in a ballistic gel. I'm pretty sure we hit it. <laughs> and look at all those wound channels. Oh man, look at this. There's an air bubble. It's like bulging. So it looks like most of them just made it all the way through the block, but we had a few shoot out the sides and surprisingly, there are two bullets stuck in the block. So here's the two bullets that we pulled out of the gel. This one is a little deformed, but they're both in pretty good shape. Well, that's it for this Full Auto Friday. I hope you enjoyed it. Maybe next time we'll try out some hollow points or maybe we'll try out the rifle. Be sure and like the video. If you're not already subscribed to Kentucky Ballistics, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Be sure and check out Kentucky Ballistics Clothing. And while you're over there, check out the Tilville Hollow Project. They're a great company with an awesome cause. Also, be sure to check out Kentucky Ballistics on Patreon, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Links to all those can be found in the description down below or you can find them on our website, KentuckyBallistics.com. Again, my name is Scott. Thank you so much for watching Kentucky Ballistics, and I'll see you next time.